Hey guys, this is Comic Uno, and today I'm doing a topic video on my fan casting for The Runaways. So if you guys don't know, um, it was announced on Hulu that The Runaways is getting a TV show, and The Runaways is one of my favorite Marvel franchises. I love this team, love the story, especially the first volume, and uh, I'm just excited for it to, to become a TV show. Uh, so of course I wanted to do my fan casting for this, and the person who recommended this was Alex Wilder, of course. Um, so Alex Wilder. Wilder, if you don't know, is a character from, from the uh, Runaways. If you want to go check out their channel in the description below, there is a link. Um, also, guys, if you have any future recommendations for topic videos, please let me know in the comments below. If I answer them, that means in a couple of weeks I'll either be on Comic Uno or Comic Frontline because I double dose my topic videos. Usually for Comic Uno, I have them every Friday with my comic book reviews, and for Comic Frontline, I have them every Sunday or Monday. So be sure to recommend away. But let's start talking about this topic video, which is my fan casting for The Runaways. So I do have some images provided that we know which actor and character. I'm talking about if you've never seen, you know, the actor, if you've never read the comic. I will help you out there. So the first character I want to talk about is Nico. So who is Nico? She is uh, kind of more of a goth character and her power is magic and she has to cut herself to, or at least have blood, um, to activate this power, at least in the beginning of this series. It kind of grew once she was in the Marvel Universe that she now has uh, only one arm, so she always has blood flowing. So she could use her magic spells whenever, but what's also interesting about her magic spells is that she only can use it once, so uh, that's also a lot of fun to see how creative she gets with her spells. So who is the person I would really like to see play this character is Arden Cho. So Arden Cho is from Teen Wolf, if you haven't seen the show, she played Kira, and uh, she was pretty badass in that show, so I think she could play uh, the badass version for Nico. so I would really like to see um, her play that character, especially now that she's not on Teen Wolf, sadly, uh, she's not going to be in this season, so maybe she'd be open to doing this. Alright, moving on to, I think, the heart of, of this series, which is Molly Hayes. So this is uh, the... the um, preteen mutant, so we can't really use the word mutant, I'm sure they'll use inhuman or something, but who would I like to play this character is Millie Bobby Brown from Stranger Things. Now, of course, she's probably, di uh, uh, of course, she's got a busy doing uh, Stranger Things, but I think, you know, if this is a short enough uh, series, if it's maybe like 12 episodes and Stranger Things is only 6 episodes usually, maybe she'll have time to play Molly Hayes, a superhero uh, for the show, because I think she got the spunk that you need for Molly Hayes. Moving on to my favorite character of, of the series, which is Carolina Dean, and she is Lucy in the Sky Diamonds. So she's an alien, she has all these rainbow type powers, kind of light powers, uh, and the person I, I would like to see play this, she hasn't done TV in a while, but I think it's an interesting uh, role for her, and that's Shane Lee Woodley. It was actually between her and Grace, uh, um, Gracie Desenni, or Grace Desenni, uh, who is from Super Ninjas and uh, Chasing Life. But so Shane Lee Woodley definitely has um, the personality to play Carolina Dean, uh, and definitely looks like the character. Moving on to Gert. This was kind of a hard one. I was actually thinking of another Chasing Life um, actor who played uh, the sister of the main character in, uh, in Chasing Life, but I decided to go with uh, Mae Whitman, who is from Parenthood. Uh, I think she could definitely play kind of that awkward character, but at the same time, again, lovable character like Gert. Um, so I would really like to see Mae Whitman play her. And just seeing a dinosaur with her would be kind of cool. <laughs> All right, moving on to Alex, which is a very important character. Don't want to spoil anything about his character, but I think his personality has to be obviously likable too. I, I, you know, it's not in the comics. He's not really an upbeat character, but I think it would be fun if they did that in the show and make him really likable. And then the twist that happens in the in the comic would be even more surprising. So I picked. From Super Ninjas, actually, uh, and I think that's it, uh, Carlos Knight. Uh, I really liked his um, his character in that show, and uh, again, I, I think the upbeat personality would be kind of fun to see with Alex. Last, this was actually really hard to pick uh, I for Chase. Chase is, 
he's hard because he he's kind of you know he's definitely the good looking guy of the group uh but he's kind of douchey but at the same time he has a heart of gold he definitely has a lot of different personalities going on so i actually picked colton haynes for this again a character that doesn't really do television that well he does television but not long stents of television he usually does a season or two uh but i would like to see him play chase i think he could be a cool chase i couldn't really think of anyone else i would want to play Chase. But uh, let me know in the comments below who would you like to see play all these characters? Do you agree with me? This is Comic You Know. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Uh, don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Uh, don't forget to like my Facebook page. Also, description below, there are links for my comic book, Like Father, Like Daughter. And don't forget to like the Facebook page of Like Father, Like Daughter. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.